Denmark is working to free itself from fossil fuels. Today, sun and wind already provide a large part of Denmark's energy and this trend is set to continue. Renewable energy is a major challenge for an energy system designed to burn fossil fuels. Energy production from the sun and wind is dependent on whether the sun shines or the wind blows. So where does the energy come from when it's cloudy and windless? Combined heat and power is an important part of the solution and Fjernvarmefun plays a vital role in the production of electricity and heat for the island of Funen. This makes the company an active player in the development of future energy systems. The good solution is to fully integrate district heating in the future energy systems. We call it fourth generation district heating, which provides the opportunity to gather all heat sources in one area. While ensuring efficient production and lower consumption through insulation, district heating ensures the optimum use of resources. This is done in cooperation with industrial companies. Modern power plants are an important part of the future energy system. They can effectively adjust the output to the fluctuating energy input that comes from the sun and wind. Fjärvarmefun primarily produces district heating at Funsvägel and Delum CHP. At Funsvägel there are three plants, respectively using waste, straw and coal as fuel. Waste incineration has several benefits. The waste is utilized while pollution and CO2 emissions are minimized and it produces electricity and district heating. The straw fire plant ensures that Fjernvarmefun supplies green energy to its customers. The coal-fired plant allows the nursery sector to buy energy at a very competitive price. This way, the production of flowers and vegetables in the island of Funen has become a massive success with a total cultivation area of over 1.5 million square meters providing many jobs in the area. After Funswerkel, Delum CHP is the largest energy producer in our district. The plant uses wood chips as fuel and supplies 12% of customers with CO2 neutral heating. District heating systems connect the power sector with the heating sector. When there's a surplus of wind power, Fjernvarmefun reduces the production at CHP plants and our large hot water tanks can provide heating as well. District heating can also be produced using heat pumps which make use of the excess production from wind turbines in strong winds. Even wastewater from the IB Müller wastewater treatment plant can be a source of heat for electricity powered heat pumps while the sludge is gasified. Biogas is also used for district heating offering three benefits environmentally friendly heating, reduced obnoxious smells and a higher quality fertilizer as the waste product. Fjernvarmefun produces and distributes district heating 24 hours a day, all year round. District heating is the circulation of hot water which is transported to consumers in a closed network of pipes and back again to the power station when the water has been cooled down. Our vision is to supply heating as cheaply and in as environmentally friendly way as possible, making the combined generation of power and heating a good solution. It makes for an energy saving production and lower prices as all the fuel is utilized. When you use district heating, the emission of CO2 is only one third of the amount of CO2 emitted by gas or oil fired burners. Industrial companies need processed energy often at high temperatures. The surplus heat can be utilized to heat the district heating water which runs around in closed network of pipes. This way, waste heat from industrial enterprises becomes profitable, both for the companies and for the individual homeowners. Albany Brewery, Glul and Marstrand and Nova Print are examples of companies that sell the surplus heat from their production and they are now suppliers of environmentally friendly energy for district heating customers. District heating is supplied from Unse to nearby towns through thousands of pipes through which the hot water streams to private customers, institutions, warehouses, industrial enterprises and nurseries. 
Eva Mifun is constantly adding new supply areas. The expansion of district heating means less pollution of the environment. At the same time, new and better insulated pipes and GPS measurements help to ensure the minimization of heat and water wastage. Fian Vamefun maintains and replaces the district heating pipes where and whenever necessary. As a result, we are at the forefront of the development in the entire district heating sector. Although we produce the majority of our heat using environmentally friendly energy, we do everything possible not to waste it. Fian Vamefun is continually improving the district heating network with new, highly insulated pipes to reduce heat loss. A total of 25 stations pump district heating to our customers. In the master control room at Fünswerkel, the technicians use advanced technology to calculate the correct pressure and temperatures. Fjernwarme Fün has 25 heating stations throughout the supply area. They can all be switched on remotely and this ensures that we can produce heating at all times, even in case of a breakdown. Fianva Mifun is a high-tech company. We constantly monitor production and distribution and we collect consumption data via electronic devices. You can also keep an eye on your own consumption via our app or on our website. And we are happy to send a text message to our customers in the event of disruptions. Our customer support center is always on hand to help with guidance and advice. Our mission is to ensure that the district heating system is optimized. Fian Vamefun cooperates with municipal corporations in creating sustainable concepts. A forest station is a joint project whereby Fian Vamefun has planted a culture of nearest trees for the forest of 31 hectares comprising 55,000 poplar trees. Over a period of up to 20 years, the poplars will be felled and made into wood chips for district heating production. The remaining trees in the forest will protect Odense's future drinking water by ensuring clean groundwater.